Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Matt and this is The Coin Pursuit. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing a new blockchain which will be released hopefully at the end of May called Mina Protocol and why I think it's going to be a game changer in crypto. So stick around. Okay, so let's go into um, the price. I'm at my screen now. Hopefully you guys can see this. So the price at the moment is $47. Um, this is on an IOU because it's actually not live yet. And basically what this means is they had a sell or a pre-sell as such. I think it was going for like 25 cents. So if you got on that, well done. I'm gutted. I found out just after it went um, live that sell, which I was pretty gutted about. But this is going to be nuts to be fair. So so basically when it launched, so it was launching for you know $20 and then all of a sudden it spiked up to $160, which is crazy. It bounced that, had a correction, bounced back. And I was consistently around about the $40-ish mark. 40 to 50 dollar mark now like i said this is on an iou basis so when people are trading at the moment on bit z they're basically buying it for the promise of getting it at a price when it's set to go on some more um exchanges so due to the unique technology and the bright future mina has and some of the backing behind it after it launched you know it hit 160 on the 18th of april and then it's gone back to like i said 30 or 40 dollars what i find crazy is it's going to be around about 20 dollars if well it's going to be i reckon it's going to be more than that personally because the the technology behind this is so crazy so First things first, what is MENA? MENA is a building a privacy preserving gateway between the real world and crypto and the infrastructure for the secure democratic future we all deserve. MENA protocol is a blockchain that is designed and is a fixed size of 22 kilobytes. That's a couple of tweets. That is insane. Now, if we compare that to Bitcoin, Bitcoin has a 315 gigabyte blockchain. So that needs downloading before a user can start authorizing transactions and to use the core wallet. Now the fixed size of 22 kilobytes basically allows everyone to use that blockchain very quickly, very effectively, and not a lot of, not a lot of processing power. Now, in terms of the smallest blockchain, you know, it doesn't compromise on security either, and it will be truly decentralized. It's the same as any other blockchain, it's just scaled down. It's actually been backed by massive, massive players. So if you go to um, Coinbase Ventures, if you scroll down, you will see here. So this is what um, Coinbase have investments in. And as you can see here, Mina is the next generation cryptocurrency through a tiny portable blockchain. So you know it's on coinbase's radar now when it is going to go on exchanges it might not go on coinbase first it might go on others but you have to be aware that coinbase do have investments in it so let's go into how i think it's different to other blockchains apart from obviously its size it's very different to other blockchains and it can prove to be a game changer in the cryptocurrency trading usually the verification process of the blockchains requires a lot of electricity and computer power. Now, Bitcoin uses more energy annually than Argentina, the whole of Argentina, which is like, it's just nuts. So you can verify trans transactions on your phone, computer, without investing any significant fund, uh, sums of hardware. Most of the blockchains don't interact with the internet. That limits their utility as well. On the other hand, MENA protocol ensures interaction with any website and access to the data on the on-chain usage. If you look at some of the stuff that the developers are saying, and I won't go into it, but you, you can look at their interviews online. It is amazing, and I'm hoping 
it will probably, well, I'm hoping it will be a massive success, but we're in the early development stages. But what they're saying on, as a, as a team is very, very promising. So how to purchase this um, crypto, this blockchain? Well, we still don't have any news yet, which um, exchange it will be listed on, but at the end of May, hopefully we will um, find it on one of their exchanges and then yeah we will I will personally be investing but obviously do your own research have a look but what I'm saying to people at the moment is think of these cryptocurrencies um, instead of Dogecoin because that's a you know a meme coin essentially have a look at cryptocurrencies that have the technology to change and better the circumstances or the situations that are happening at the moment and if you're looking at um, blockchain as a whole you know China and um, a lot of other countries they're using a lot of power to mine coins like Bitcoin and stuff like that and with this technology they might you know it could lead to less processing power, which leads to saving money, which leads to a lot more investors. So try and have a look at crypto along them lines. I know sometimes it's nice to invest in these altcoins that will just skyrocket and they don't really have any development backing. So yeah, just be aware of that. So from me, I believe it's safe to say that MENA protocol is the next one on my list of purchases might not be yours but again like I said please do your research and it will make the blockchain a lot more faster a lot more secure and yeah I can't really have nothing bad to say let's hope this video does not get shut on when it gets released but anyway um, so yeah this is why I think Mina is a good investment when it comes out I just think it's really good to know and get on their website and have a look for yourself so thank you guys for watching this video i hope you really enjoyed it um if there's anything you want to know or any more um cryptos that you want me to cover then please let me know i'm always happy to um research them as well for you guys and uh, present them and yeah if you have any questions please let me know in the comments Thank you for watching everyone. I hope you're safe and stay tuned to the next one. Peace. I'm going to be reviewing a new blockchain called Mina Bro...